Boston. Horford and Porzingis are man in the post position. The wing pairing, it's White and Brown. And it's Holiday in at the point. And he's been much more assertive here in the second half, getting to his spots, executing with ease. Pass to Porzingis. Good D by Siakam. Not his best efficiency this quarter. Sometimes that's how it goes. To the inside. It doesn't go for him. Nice D from Porzingis. Outside Holiday. Mr. Persingas. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. It's going to be on Siakam. And in the paint, Porzingis doesn't give the defense any opportunity there. He just stays aggressive and draws the foul. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for Boston. Look, throughout this entire game, they've done a great job of drawing fouls. And as a result, they've got a ton of points from the free throw line. That's keeping them in it. And another thing they've been doing all game long is knocking down the three. Shooting has been a big part of their game plan tonight. That free throw good from Porzingis. And if they continue, Kevin, their outstanding free throw shooting, that'll help them seal the deal. And both free throws, good for Porzingis. Some big guys struggle at the line. Not him. He's put in the work to defy that assumption. Pass to Siakam. Over Hofford. And too long on the shot. Austin leading by nine. Brown outside. And he uses the glass on the way. Brown's got five points now this quarter. They're in strong position coming down the stretch, and he is a big reason why. Now, here's McConnell. Outside Matherin. Ball's not loose. Just five to shoot. Fires high post. It'll go. The Boston lead is put down to nine in the bucket from Siakam. As a player, a rough first half, look, it can wake you up. Sometimes it leads to much improved play in the second half. And White gets to Holland. And there's the foul. It'll go on Tyrese Halliburton. That's his fifth foul. And it's clear he's been a little out of control here tonight. The refs clearly have their eyes on him. And that's number five. Tatum, he's checked in for Al Horford. And the Pacers also making a change. Nemhard's checked in. Now here's White. Not a lot of room. The pass to Persingas. Just four to shoot. Austin needs to get off his shot. White, good. White's got the lead at the 12 now for the Celtics. Three-point shooting since the half has been about as good as you could ask for. McConnell finds Matherin. And what? there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brown. That'll be his second foul of the game. And, and that's, it's close, but, you know, didn't get on balance quick enough. McConnell against Tully. Shot clock at six. Here's Turner. And Porzingis demonstrating there why he's an effective two-way player. Positioning himself well there to just bother the shooter. Tatum. Tatum gets it to go inside. It's a plus five advantage for them in rebounding after that one. Pass to Turner. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And it's crucial that Turner remains assertive like this because it's how he's going to get these calls.
first free throw is good. And a lot gets said about Turner's defensive impact. But he's been cultivating his offensive game as well, becoming a bigger threat in that regard. All three throws good from Turner. Tatum with it. To the middle. Here's Brown. And Brown throws it down. One of the premier screen wins in the NBA. Jalen Brown is out of the game. Pacers trail by 14. Now McConnell. Siakam inside. Tatum on him. And he gets it to go. You know, he was a non-factor in that first half, but now he's making up for lost time. And here's Holiday. Outside Tatum. Brown outside. The three. The Pacers pull it in. Nemard got his fifth rebound in this one. Pass to Siakam. Over Tatum. Siakam's shot is off. Very dangerous to leave a guy like that open. Lucky right there to throw the deep. Right the pass to Brown. Siakam against Tatum. Here's Persingas. This will blow. His bucket is good. And he'll have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. And what a motor. Persingas is an all-star talent who is also willing to do the dirty work. The Pacers making a switch here. Halliburton's checked in. Find the lanes. Find the lanes. One shot. That free throw good from Porzingis. And at 7-3, Porzingis could have been just another big, but he defies expectations. He's got such an impressive array of abilities. Here's Turner. Porzingis with the rebound. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Celtics. And if ever there were a way to kick off the NBA Conference Finals, this is it. Going to be a table-setting victory here in Game 1 for Boston. Two great rebounding teams. And these guys worked just a little bit harder tonight, and that was the edge they needed. And they open these conference finals with a forceful performance to take the early lead in the series. Yeah, they, they talked about sending a message here in game one, and no doubt about it, they delivered that message loud and clear. It's obvious who has the upper hand going forward in this series. And we watched him all night long. No one could really stop him. Just another excellent game it was for Jalen Brown. We certainly got to see his best effort on offense, attacking the defense without fear and grabbing a lot of buckets. Indiana making some changes. Jalen Smith, he's checked in for Miles Turner. Toppin comes in for Pascal Siakam. And it's Neesmith in for Benedict Matherin. Four on the shot clock. Fires away from way outside. And it's Halliburton missing. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Pritchard passes to Hauser. Outside, Brzingis. Passes it to Pritchard. The tray. Toppin pulls it in. Here's Halliburton. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. A uh, pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum is so, so critical. And you know they'll want to ride this wave into game two. 
And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Please drop Thank you, Kevin. We'll KP, you, you guys time. did a great job contesting shots and disrupting their offense. What did you like best about the defensive effort tonight? I think from the beginning of the game, we just started off uh, aggressive. We were connected defensively, and uh, that's how we were able to stop them. You got it done when it counted for stuff. Thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. All right, DA, thanks again. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for tuning in. So long and good night, everyone.